Hello there, here, and we are back with Mirror Drama Paradise Bill. Hello, Shunta. Oh, okay, so I didn't notice this yesterday, but if I press quit, look at this. Look at that. That's so stylistic. I love that. I also just find out that all the music in this game are created by the game developer, which is like crazy. All the art, all the music, all the cinematics. Cinematography, the writing, that, that's crazy. Uh, morning already? Somehow I feel more tired than usual. Must have been from all that walking around and not used to. Eh, maybe it was all a dream. Uh, yes, let's continue playing the game shortly, I forget to say that. Me join the club. My friends. It's almost fun. Almost... Uh-huh. No. I'm not nearly creative enough to make all of that up. But... Uh, this bed is so comfortable. I think I'm gonna... Me, 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 me. Fall asleep. I almost fall asleep. I better get out of this heavenly place and get ready. Yeah, I get ready for what? Man, the sun is really bright. I can't believe people actually go outside like this every day. Scythe, I hope it gets cold soon. I think it's snowing, huh? Oh, <laughs> that's an amazing transition. That's a way to do transition. You enter your classroom. Scythe. Yo, Shunta! Eh, eh! This guy again. I see I've returned to the world of living. What's that even supposed to mean? <laughs> Uh, well, didn't want to miss any more school than I already have. Is my model blocking the thing? Well, at least not that much as before. I was like, yesterday when I was editing, I realized my model was blocking stuff, so I was like, mm, maybe I should reduce the size of my model. You know what? I'm, I will reduce the size of my model again. BRB. Okay, I think I'm gonna settle with this amount of transparency. It's good enough that I can see through. But what's gonna use, shall we? Didn't want to miss any more school than I already have. I guess. Hey, that's the spirit. Alright, class, settle down. Hey, I said settle down. Much better. We didn't even do it. We didn't even do anything. Who the heck? After a long day of attempted learning, you return to the classroom. Wait, let me just my seat. Ah, Shira san, welcome back. Glad to see you didn't bail out on us. Y yeah, okay. Well, I'm not the type to break a promise so easily. You lied to her face, but it seems she didn't notice. You are just in time. We were about to play a game. A game? Yeah, I couldn't miss any back since they're gonna be a little bit late, so I figured this would be a good way to pass the time. I suppose that's the price, to pay. That's the price we pay for showing up on time. Oh, come on. It'll be fun. So you wanna join us? Sure. Eh, sure, why not? Sure, I guess so. Great, the game we'll be playing is called Multiples of 3. You know how to play, right? No? No. no. Oh. Oh, well. <laughs> Concern. Alright. Basically, we go in a circle and come, come up from 1. And if you reach a multiple of 3, such as 6 or 9, you clap instead. And we keep going on until one of us fails. Very simple, right? Yeah, I think I get it. I hope you do. This isn't exactly rocket science. Okay, ready? One, two, three, up. <laughs> uh huh. Shi Shira san, you were supposed to clap. Oh, wait, that counts. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. You said multiples are free, I didn't think. Okay, let's start over. Fine. Go ahead, Danny. Okay. One, two, four, five. Are you, you're supposed to clap. <laughs> you're supposed to clap, Shinta. Wait, isn't it always going to land on me? Oh, wait, you're, <laughs> you're right. You're absolutely right. Suddenly you hear a door open. Yo! 
Sorry, we're late. We're uh, Bucky Bur Bucky Burger stage light. What? What? No, no, we broke it. Oh, really? I don't remember that part. H hold on, what happened? We had gym for last period, and you know how the gym has a stage right next to it with all the stage lights and stuff on it. Y yeah. I bet Bucky hunted 1,000 yen she couldn't hit one of them with a basketball. Why would you do that? <laughs> I mean, sure. <laughs> That's cool. Turns out she had a really good aim. Bucky. Yeah, yeah, but... I wouldn't have done it if I had been challenged, so, yeah. Good point, it's completely and totally my fault. But yeah, we had to get chewed out by teachers and stuff. We got off with just warning though, which was pretty cool, all things considered. Well, at least you two are here now. Now we can begin our club activities. So, girls. Oh, and Shira-san. Now that the worst of finding a new member are behind us. I think it's about time we plan for something big. How do you mean? Well, if your clubs get that big thing they're working to towards, the music club is currently doing live house shows, the art club is planning on painting a mur mural, even if our sports clubs are training for nationals, I just think it'd be nice to join in for a fun. But what can we even do? Well, we are a drama club, aren't we? I say we try to put out a theatrical production. Oh, okay, I thought you you were going to say just that we make some drama, you know, like, causing some chaos in school, fire burning, explosion again, which is cool. Uh, let me check my recording voice, barely. Alright, everything looks fine. I say we tr try to put on a theatrical production. Uh, a play? As in standing on stage in front of a bunch of people can you play? Oh, that sounds like fun. No, no it doesn't. A play, huh? I don't know, sounds like... sounds like a lot of work. Cha, you joined this club, didn't you? You can just be expected to show up and not contribute. Contribute. Hmm? What do I have to contribute? Ooh. I'm not... A performer. I don't even know the first thing about this club. I don't deserve to be here. Why am I here? Good question. No, I remember. The real reason I joined. It wasn't because of their lack of members. It wasn't out of passion over the subject. I want to be part of something. Even if it's a little scary. Even if it's out of my comfort zone. I want... Friends. Hanmi. Huh? The play I say we do it. In fact... I'll play the main role. <laughs> oh, I love that. I love the way everyone is like... Woo! -hoo. Wow, even a quiet guy want to do this. Um, guess that just leaves you, Kurumi. Sure, alright, I guess. But only as long as I get to play the villain. <laughs> Great, then it's settled. Our goal for this club is to perform a play. I'm gonna die. <laughs> mm hmm. After the meeting concluded, you return home. Man, what a long day. Still can't believe I volunteer to be the main role. I probably could have just done behind the scenes stuff now that I think about it. Eh, who knows, maybe it'll be fun. Certainly a lot more interesting than seeing this room all day. Scythe. Well, not like I'll even have to worry about that for a while. Let's just enjoy things as they are. Um, like this bed. So soft. Me 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 me. Is it another dream you're having? September the Thursday, Tuesday, not Thursday, Wednesday. I love that. I love. I just love this game. I just I woke up a little later than I would have wanted. I'm just so used to sleeping, I... Whatever, it's fine, not like I care about my grades or anything. I mean, I've already missed so much school, I doubt it'll matter one way or the other. For now, all I care about is making friends and socializing. 
Speaking of which, I shall try and get everyone's number. Yeah, it'll be my goal for today to get the numbers of all my club members. Shunda! Uh oh. Hey Shunda, I didn't know you walked this road. I'll make sure it's different next time. Haha, <laughs> hey, what do you got there? Huh, you mean my phone? Yeah. Hey, let's exchange numbers. You just take away my phone, okay. But wait, hey, give me back, give me back my phone. And on, you just get yourself a new contact. Huh, you are... Only contact. It's... It's a new phone. Oh, I... I see. <laughs> Angie. Well, I'll go on ahead. See you in class. Whew. See, See ya. It seems like you made your first contact. As your friend in this gonna used to grow, you'll be able to contact him whenever you play like hanging out. That is of course unless they are busy or feel unwell. Yeah, I know how fun works. Scythe, well one connects better than none, I guess. Hopefully it'll be this easy with the rest of them. Yeah, indeed. After a long day of attended learning, you return to the clubroom. Ah, hello Shiro-san. Hey. Now here- Now where has Becky-chan gone after you? Probably you'll have to go drag someone else here against their will. Gosh, I hope not. So sorry again about that, Shiro-san. No worries. If anything, I'm glad to turn out this way. Um, come to think of it, I haven't seen much of Suneko either. Oh, perhaps she's keeping an eye on her. Now if there's one thing that'll keep Suni from the Karama Club, it's... Cookies! Woohoo! Freshly baked! <laughs> oh, okay. Me, Dory. Oh goodness! There you two are! Apologies for the wait. We had a home economic class before this and well... Hey, you know, I had just to sneak a, fi a feel out. Wait, you made this, Momoko-chan? Yep, figured it'd be a good way to celebrate having a new member around. And a member. <laughs> Meme. But, wow, thanks. Alright then, first clap activity of the day is to enjoy, is to enjoy these sweets. Now I'll place our plates of treats in the center of the table. As each of them take a bite, you notice their faces light up one by one. You follow suit and immediately your taste buds are overcome with intense flavor. So let's say it was a good cookie. Mmm. Um, so good. So good. Please do not talk with your mouthful, Kermichan. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, matters or whatever. God, whoever invented those was a real dork. Dork or not, at least they aren't making a mess of themselves. I mean, yeah. <laughs> Look at that expression. They're probably dead. I love this. I'd be scared if they were still eating. Hey, hey let's change the subject. This is for a new member after all. Why don't you tell us about yourself? Oh, uh... What shall I say? Anime? I like I like these cookies. I've got nothing. I like games. I like reading. I like this. I like these cookies. I uh, I like these cookies. I should have saved there. BRB. I like these cookies. I uh, I like these cookies. That's not a personality trait. Hmm. <laughs> you mean is? Thank you, by the way, Shikun. No problem, I guess. Shikun. That's my new name for you. I like to take people's name and cutify them. She does this a lot. Oh, how about this? Let's all go in circle and talk about what we like. I'll go first. I like... Theater. Mm hmm. What? Is that too obvious? No, it's, it's fine. It's fine. You are the club person after all. Uh, ah, ah. Well, it's true though. My dream is to become a Broadway actress. Good for you. Good for you. N not like it will ever happen or anything. Danny. Ah, uh, ah, uh, right, right. Believe in yourself, okay? I'm supposed to say a nice thing about myself. Do you? I personally don't... Me, I'm personally okay with saying bad stuff about myself. As long as... What do you call it? it it just feels like a way to introspect and respect and reflect on our actions and things that we do, which is like amazing and I love it. Just don't do it too much. So yeah. Uh-huh. 
Next. Sigh. Sigh. That's what it is my turn now. As a vice president, I too am passionate about theater. However, I'm certainly more interested in the literature aspect of things. Some might call me a bookworm. And your name is Kurumi. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> bookworm. Hey, hey, it's true. Nevertheless, someday I hope to be a writer of sorts. Perhaps I'll be writing the very same play you performed for Broadway, Danny. Hey, I see you. Guess I'll go next. All right, Bucky, your turn. <laughs> what? What? Come on now, you've got to say something about yourself. Ah, uh, fine. I like a uh, hurting people. Uh huh. Okay, my turn. Relatable. Well, let's see. I like baking, obviously. I like a uh, other food-related activities. How are you forgetting the most obvious things? I, I can relate with all of these characters in a way. I, I, I love all of them. <laughs> um, uh, you're the captain of the basketball team. Oh, you're right. I'm a basketball player. Hey. <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, I guess that covers everyone. What do you think, Shiro? We are quite a group now. Y yeah, you, you could say that. They do seem like an interesting bunch. Maybe too interesting. I almost kind of stand out weirdly now. Compared to them, I'm so... Bland. How could I ever be friends with any of them? I bet they even have each other's... Numbers? Ah! Phone numbers! Huh? Shit, why did I yell that? I mean... We should probably exchange number or something. Uh... Or not, I... I, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Oh, great idea! It's not a great idea, you're just saying that. It's important to keep in touch in case of emergencies. Or if something comes up, then you'll be late for a meeting. Oh, yeah. I just wanted a girl's number, but that makes sense. I don't think that was your intention back then, wasn't it? Oh, let's give all this script. Let's all give this script our number, I guess. Eh? -e? She's right, I am a creep. Now, now. Let's give him a chance. Here, hand me my phone so I can put my details in. Oh, sure. Hmm. What? One contact, huh? G g Just kill me already. After exchanging numbers, you all go se your separate ways. Separate. That's cool. As you venture towards your home, you feel a vibration in your pocket. Look at that. Huh? Oh, it's my phone. So that's what a phone call feels like. Let's see who it is. Hello? Ah, Nokia. <laughs> it's Nokia, I love it. Hey, hey Shira-san. Uh, this is Shira-san, right? Y yeah Oh, great. I just uh, wanted to check on in on you. I know the other girl's gonna be a bit... rude for like a better term. So I wanted to make sure you feel welcome. Um, do you? I think so. Good, good. Uh, so... That's all I wanted to say. Oh, okay. I'm... I'm going to hang up now. The call has ended. Well, it's nice to know I'm not the only one who's terrible with phone calls. <laughs> yeah. It seems as if your fellow club members will contact you every now and then. Sometimes with requests, other times just talk. Whether or not you accept these requests, always make sure to respond to them and never leave them on read. Otherwise, they may begin to send you. God, I, I leave so many people on read, I'm sorry. I, I, I just do that when I'm too tired to deal with stuff, I just left people on read and then respond a few days later. And I think that's fine. Like, I think that's fine. 
you, you don't need to be on your phone 24 7 you know? Whatever. Let's just get home already. Can't believe it got this dark so fast. Guess it's just another thing I get, I guess, used to. September 4th, Wednesday. 5th, Thursday. Scythe, back here once again. Gotta say I'm starting to get used to it. Heh. Nah. At the very least, I wonder what kind of, what kind of shenan shenanigans we will be getting up to in the club room. Scythe, if only I could just skip this part. Yo, Shunta! And this part, dude. How are you holding up, buddy? Where are buddies now? Uh, fine, I guess. Nice, nice. Hey, I was gonna ask. Did you ever find a club? You a club to join? Uh. Yes. No. This is an interesting intersection. I think. What if I say no? No, no, I didn't. Ah, for real? I'm still getting used to things around here. Yeah, I guess that's fair. But I'm telling you, Jaden. Okay, I thought you were going to recur as the club. Uh, I. We'll see later. For now, let's just enter yes then. I did, actually. Oh, for real? Which one? No, wait, let me guess. Anime club, huh? No, no. Oh, video game club? No. Uh, the occult club? Why would I? There's an occult club? I love it. I, I will join that. I forget to be in a club full of creepy weirdos or something. What does that mean? What does that mean? Hello? Oh, that makes sense. Well, what is it then? Uh, the drama club. Drama club? Ha! Huh, didn't take you for the hit arcade type. Well, it just sort of happened, I guess. Still, though, must have been real convincing. Are there any girls in there? Ha <laughs> ha! Do we need to talk about this? Uh, yeah, it's mostly girls actually. Ah, okay. Sure. That's not what you think. Sure, sure. Just make sure to save some of them for the rest of us, eh? Whatever. Uh, okay, that was kind of awkward, frozen. For a bit. After a long day of internet learning, you return to the club room. Ah, there you are, Shiro san. Hm, hm, took you long enough. We were just about to discuss something important. Huh? Am I being kicked out already? No, no. Sin is just being mean. Yeah, besides, we kinda need you so we don't get shut down. You can worry about getting kicked out when someone else joins. <laughs> oh, okay. G guys, don't scare him like that. Oh, but if you're in his eyes, he's just so adorable. Huh? Um, it is quite amusing when you like it. look at it that way. Getting kicked out doesn't sound too bad anymore. <laughs> What does it mean? Uh, so, what are we discussing exactly? Well, you see, we've decided to perform a play, but we're not sure what play to per perform. Uh, so we are just choosing what story to go with? Precisely. It has to be something wondrous, something captivating. But we just can't seem to set on one. Maybe you can help. Uh, well... I don't know a lot about, a lot about theater, but I'll see what I can do. Great! Great! Let's all go around and propose our play ideas. <laughs> I have a proposition. Oh? Behold. Oh, deep his Rex! What? That's an Oedipus. It's only the most influential, influential literary work of our time. Written by the great Sophocles, Sophocles himself. Who the hell is that? Hmm, commoner. If he's a commoner, why do you like him so much? <laughs> Goddamn. Perhaps you shall describe the plot to us? Certainly. It's a tragedy about a king known as Oedipus. Oedipus. Despite his massive wealth and success, he's prophesied to lose everything. He's caused the idea before inevitably causing each prediction to happen through his own arrogance. In the end, he comes to a great illness and perishes. That is the story of 
Oedipus Rex. <laughs> yeah, that, that's that's the part that I'll remember. Oh yeah, doesn't he bang his mom or something? Eh? I yes, that has happen at some point. Well, that's certainly an option. <laughs> Any objections? Hell yes, I have an objection. What about West Side Story? It's about two demises who fall in love. But each of them are part of a rival gang. Warren Shears. So essentially, Romy and Juliet. But with more violence. Oh. I don't think you were a fan of love stories. Eh? No, I just choose it because we'll get to play around with guns. Hey, anyone else? Ooh, ooh! Pick me, pick me! Uh, sure, go for it. What about a Midsummer Di Night's Dream? That shaky spear guy wrote it. Oh, you know it, huh? Oh, did she feel that? Feel what? The ground move. I think that shaky spear just... Shaky spear guy <laughs> just wrote... Just wrote in his grave, how do say that? Is that not his name? Uh, how about you go ahead and recap the story, Bucky? Oh, sure. So like there's two couples who are having a relationship issues, right? But one day, they go into the woods and a fairy decides to fix them by using cupid arrows. But then he ends up shooting the wrong people, causing a whole lot of mix-ups. And then, I think there's a horseman involved? I forget how it ends, but it got something like that. Okay, well... This all seems like pretty good choices. But if I could add one in the mix, I think Last Miss could be a good pick. Ooh. This is all, all surprisingly top tier, but I'm not really into classic literature. I'm more into, into a modern literature type of person. What was that song? Last Miss? Well, the full title is Less Miserables. Le what? It's French. Le for Lec Ma Balls. I'm sorry about that. Anyway, it's about a man who is re released from prison after 19 years. Seeing for goodness, he agrees to look after a child of a working class lady who is in need money. However, he ends up on the run after breaking parole. There, there's a bit more to it, but that's just the gist of it. Personally, I think it's quite overrated. What a cynical thing to say. So, sure, son. Um? Do you have any suggestions? Uh... Oh wow, he's really hitting hard with this one. I think I see steam coming out of his ears. Nah, I got nothing. What a letdown. <laughs> I love that expression. Well, how about this then? Oh, sorry, a delivery is coming in. There we go. Okay, let's continue. Well, how about this then? Let's, let's let your son pick one of our suggestions. Hmm. He doesn't know anything about theater. Exactly. If we really want to impress everyone, let's let someone with no theater knowledge choose. Uh, I guess that makes sense. Alright then, sure, son. Which place should we go with? Uh, is it choice time? <laughs> oh, 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 that's lovely. I, I love it. I, lo I love the design of everything here in this game. Oedipus Rex, West Side Story, Midsummer Night, Less Miserables. Oedipus Rex. I guess I'll go with uh, Otis or whatever. Alright, Oedipus Rex it is. Good choice. Now that we have our place selected, let's all go home for today. I know it's a bit early, but they'll give us more time to research our play tonight. We can just give people on Oedipus Rex a gun, you know, and then make it also a love story. Which it kinda already is. Oh no, 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 no. I just remembered the story of when it was Rex. They did mention it in the game. <laughs> uh, but yeah, there's no gun in the game, so yeah, just just make a combination out of it. That would be cool. Wait, research? Well, assuming any of us aren't already familiar with it, you don't have to go see a live performance or anything. Just look it up online or read the book version if you like. Read a book? Oh no. After a long day, you return home and reflect on your experience. Man, what a day. It's already 5 dude. So I better get researching that play or whatever. 
What is it called again? Oh, the puss? What does that even mean? You put up your computer to, inf to investigate. I don't really like using this thing. It's slow and loud and it's not like there's really anything to do on here. Well, other than looking at place written a thousand years ago. I bet in a few years the internet's gonna completely die out or something. <laughs> completely. Anyways, there's a description of it. Wow, that's quite a few words there, isn't it? Perhaps I can just not read this. <laughs> yeah, I'll just go up the description to snack a sun perverted earlier. It's just a play. How incomprehensible can it be? Oh no. Well, good luck. Smiley face. September 5th, Thursday. September 6th, Friday. Scythe and Nerdy. Friday to be specific. I wonder how I'm gonna spend my weekend. Uh, maybe he could work up a courage to ask one of the girls to hang out. I suppose that requires any amount of courage in the first place. Maybe some other time. You entered your classroom. Back here once again. Yo, Shunta! Hey. So as of the day you've been here a whole week, how you're holding up? Good, fine, I guess. Good. Pretty good, I suppose. Nice, nice. I know switching schools can be a bit of a hassle. I've been there myself, actually. R right, switching. He's not putting some transport student, and there's just someone who's been skipping this whole time. I prefer to keep it that way, it's embarrassing otherwise. So, what was the old school like, by the way? Eh? Uh. It was a big school. It was a small school. More or less, say. It was big. It was a big school. It was a lot bigger than this one. What? Really? Yeah, back in, uh, Shibuya. Why am I thinking about Ohio? Y you came from Shibuya? Dude, you have to show me around there someday. Oh no. Sh sure thing. Hell yeah, I love, I love lying and digging yourself deeper into problems in the future. After a long day's attempt attempted hearing, learning, you return to the club room. Oh jeez, it's looking like it might rain soon. Oh, can we go jamming in the puddle with us? But Bucky, you remember what ha happened last time, right? There was a last time. Maybe you hit your head a little too hard. He hey, what? What? She just arrived. Ah, uh, welcome back. Did she just call me Shija? Just go with it. Hey, hey, it's a manga reference. Well, congratulations, you managed to survive your first week here. I'm gonna lie, I can expect you to flag on us. Hey, what did it say about being rude to the new member? Oh, that wasn't an insult towards him. I'm generally impressed you didn't get sick of us already. No? What? No way, you're you're all a bunch of interrogating bunch. Oh well, thanks I guess. Hey, we shall do something fun this weekend to celebrate having a new member stick around. Oh well, what do you have in mind? I didn't think that far ahead. Hmm, I heard tell of a new mall opening up downtown. I believe it was called Neon Paradise. Oh yeah, I heard of that place. I heard they've got a store that a store that gets get murder records imported all the way from America. Hell yeah. M murder? Shh, it's only the reddest and baddest bunny I've ever damn heard. Say, you're such a metalhead. I don't know when I hear that from someone who listens to mainstream shit. I generally can tell if that's an insult. Hey, <laughs> hey, back on the topic. That's all in favor of going to the mall. Ooh, ooh, me! Me? Me as well. Seems like mostly everyone is in. What about you, your son? Me? Uh. Sure, I can't, sure. Sure, I guess. Great, then it's settled. If no one objects, I say we go on Sunday. Tomorrow is opening day, so it might be obnoxiously crowded. Ah, uh, good point. I'm not the biggest fan of crowded space anyways. You and me both. Mm-hmm. Is it mall time? It's mall time. It's mall time. Oh wait, this is not the mall. 
As the time for cups to end has come around, you all part way of day. Hmm. I managed to spend a whole week going to school. This I could use this as a thumbnail, I think. I I like this. I'm glad I said you get out of the house. Scythe, but now it's the weekend. So I'm so sorry have to A clap of thunder catches your attention. Rain has begun to fall. I love that. I love the transition. Oh hey! Oh, hey Shunta! Eh? This guy? Funny when nature runs into each other, huh? Yeah, funny. Wait, what do you look different? My nature is coming down hard out there. You think I've got my lucky umbrella? Lucky? Yeah, I usually forget to bring it whenever it rains. But somehow it always ends up in my bag. Huh. I, uh... I didn't bring any umbrella. Oh! You wanna borrow mine? Huh? No, then you'll get rain on. Nonsense, we can share. Come on, I'll just for a little while. We can stop by a cafe or something and wait for the storm to die down. You both under huddle underneath the umbrella and prefer to enter the weather. Ah, jeez, I get my socks all wet. Yeah, me too. Worst part is, that's probably not less of it. Eh, it's not that bad. I actually kinda like the rain. Really? Yeah, it's relaxing. Especially at night when you hear the rain against your window. Huh, I always found that can, kind of stuff annoying. Guess we all like different things, huh? Hey, speaking of which, wanna grab something while we are here? Uh, uh, I don't really have any money, so... Huh, you really don't seem to prefer for anything, do you? Don't worry, I'll pay us for, for us both. Eh, really? Yeah, you don't have to. Eh, why not? It's it's only a couple of yen anyways. Thanks. Don't mention it. I'll get some mango juice, that sounds good. Sh sure. Alrighty. Huh, he's really is a nice guy. Kinda annoying, but still nice. He reminds me of a typical shonen protagonist. Bald kind, a little airheaded, but always mean well. Meanwhile, I'm more like an isekai protagonist, okay. Land, boring, uninteresting. Scythe, if only I had some trait that made me interesting. You do. You you you, you do have a trait that makes you look, look interesting. You look like a lab rat that is very experimentable. <laughs> I'm sorry to mention that, but yeah. You have the race, I guess. I'm back. Ha, you ever had any of the drinks here? No, I... I don't go outside very much. Ah, oh, what a shame. These are the best drinks in the city. Does it just say that about everything lives? Well, hey, if you're ever itching to get out of the house, I'm always free. Eh, don't you have like 60 clubs to go to? Eh, I can make time for it. Right now I'm supposed to be practicing volleyball, but... Whoops, turns out I'm here. But why though? Hmm, what do you mean? Why makes time to just... drink mango just with some guy you barely know? You know, you remind me a lot of someone. You and him will probably make good friends. He's someone who... <clears throat> okay, I'm sorry, my throat is... Can I... Going in? He's someone who didn't get out loud either. I practically forced him back in, out into society. He's what you might call an introvert. And um, I think I see where this is going. Do you? Yeah, he just wanna force me into an extrovert too, huh? No, not at all. No, the thing is... Did, did something happen to your friend? I was unsuccessful. He's still the same shadow he was back then. And eventually I just stopped trying. All I'm saying is, not everyone is an extrovert. Some people are just introverted. And that's... okay. What a nice lesson you have. The only thing that matters is... that you're a person. You're a kind person living in this world. To be yourself. Wow, did you just read my mind? Wait, you can read minds? You should join the telepathy club. Tell how many clubs does this school have? <laughs> I've lost I've lost count at this point. Oh, uh, we have the uh, what do you call it? We have the We have the banana club, we have the uh, clone club, we have the uh, Lich of Legends club. Yes. 
Lich of Legends only, not other games. We have the Furry Club, um, much, and much more. Oh hey, the rain's stopping for a bit. I think I'm gonna head out for now, but we should hang out like this again sometime. Sh sure. Alrighty then, I'll see you next Monday, dude. Yeah, see ya. After enjoying your time at the cafe, the two of you go your separate way. September 7. Set your day. Set your day. Set your day. Set your mama. Got him. Oh. Mm -hmm. After a peaceful night of rain and thunder, you wait. Another day. It's the weekend, the weather's cleared up, and I've got a whole lot of people I can ask to hang out with. All I've got to do is c call them. Uh, maybe Momoka Chen will. No, no, surely she's busy. Maybe Murasaki san. Eh, she kinda scares me. <laughs> no, I think. I think she is a sweet person. Momoka Chen probably not be that busy. Midori san? Um, no, she scares me even more somehow. The only person I can really think to call is. Aoki san. But. Uh, even then, it just feels awkward to have to ask somebody to hang out. Especially as someone I don't know very well. Besides, she'll think I'm creepy for even thinking about it. Yeah, it's definitely safer to just not call any of them. Yeah. Alright, let's get settled. So then, what should I do now? Read. <laughs> you sure you don't want to call them? Okay. Oh, the difficult routine. Let's go, read manga. Okay, let's do that then. You said you definitely wrote of manga once more. As you do, the troubles that surround you seem to fade away just as it always has. However, the fun is all but temporary. You got a phone call? It isn't long before you remember the feeling which sent you down this path. Ah, okay. That feeling is now stronger than before. What is this feeling? I don't know. Is it a good or a bad feeling? Is it the light of the outside world that's calling you? Or is it a beast of on your heart that tells you that you should go back to this room? Well, it seems I'm all out of stuff to do. Perfect timing as well, it's about time for dinner. Hmm, dinner. I'm all out of food, aren't I? Now let me check the kitchen. I'm probably just remembering wrong. Here's the answer to your kitchen in search of something you eat. You're all out of food. Time to go. Time to go outside. Okay, let's start by looking in the fridge. The swing door open, open in search of something, anything, but nothing. Uh, okay. Maybe the cabinet. We search there as well, but still nothing. Hmm. Let me look in the fridge again. You open the door once more. As one of many imagined, there was still nothing there. Wow! There's nothing! Open it again. Magic! There's nothing! Damn it. Fine, I guess I've gotta get something delivered. What shall I order? Pizza. I was about to mention pizza and there was pizza. I was like thinking about pizza. Burger. Bento. Ooh. Tough choice. Just burger, I guess. I'm not a big fan of burgers. Whatever, I gotta get something bad to appreciate the good, right? Good. Okay. Alright, I guess I've got to call them. How fitting. You find a number to an nearby burger delivery place and said to give them a call. You slowly press out the number listed, making sure not to mess up. As you enter the last digit, the dial tone rings against your ear. The sounds make you uncomfortable, and the amount of time that passes does not make it any better. Every ring that emanates from the speaker makes you grip the phone even tighter. Without realizing it, your other arm reaches over and grabs the phone table all on its own. Your index finger hooks around the lips and begins to twirl. Just as you are about to set the phone back down, the last dial tone is interrupted. Oh, still using that old phone, okay. Someone picked up. Hello, thank you for calling Steven's Burger and Fries. How may I help you? Uh, hi, I am, uh... Shit, I'm already messing up. <laughs> no, no, it's, it's fine. Sorry, sir, can you speak up a little? Ah, uh, sorry. I'll like a pizza. Oh, pi pizza. Burger, I mean burger. Alright, any kind in particular? Oh, yeah, uh... Uh, whatever's the first option, please. Oh, no. What? Like when you order and got the options, like 
it has the pictures and it'll say number one and number two and stuff. Like number one, please. Scythe, alright, will that be all, sir? Did you just scythe on me? <laughs> oh, wow, okay. Yes. Oh, no, wait, can you add the soda to that? No, Miss Soda, to be specific. Alright, how big? Me medium. Alright, that'll be 1,700 1, yen. Okay, thank you. You're on the call? Uh, I hate phone calls. But I think I did, I did better than last time I had to order food. Did you mention our address? <laughs> I was thinking that I didn't give an address. I'll just order someplace else. <laughs> it's a day, September 8th, Sunday. Is it the day? Maybe it is the day. Is it the day? The day, the day that we've been waiting. No, I don't want to get demonetized. That's a, that's a song that has been monetized somewhere else. Today's the day. Today I will be going to the mall with the drama club. Uh, how, how do I do this? I shall, uh, ask when to meet up, but should I wait for someone to call? No, you, uh, you, you cool, but, uh, but it's much more safer to just, you know, text someone about it. Oh, also I kind of feel sick. That's, that's bad. <laughs> I'm not really sure. Uh, yeah. Should I wait for someone to call? Yeah. Or call someone myself? Call! Let's go. Right, right, I should call one of them first. Alright, uh, I'm just gonna select the contact. Let's go with Aoki san. And now I will. Uh, shall I really call her? Call! Yeah, yeah, I should. Here, here goes. I love how the call button is larger than the other. Call! Aw. Hello. He hello. Ah, uh, hi. Um, it's Shiro. Ah, uh, yeah. I figured. You still have for a trip to the mall? Yeah, yeah. Great. See you there. Okay. Bye. The call has ended. Wait, well, that wasn't so bad. I, I did it again, didn't I? Hello. Oh. Yeah. Hi, ah, yes, I forget this. Okay, okay, I thought it would, you said that out loud. And they heard it. Yeah, I forget to ask what time we are meeting up. It's Shiro, by the way. Yeah, I know. I know, you don't need to. A anyways, I was thinking maybe sometimes around 10, that way we can have lunch after walking around for a bit. Lunch. Y yeah, sounds good. Okay, see you there. The call has ended once more. Yikes, I'll never get used to that thing. Lunch, huh? Guess that means I've got a scratch to get her some cash. Let's see, it's been a while. Did I mute the game accidentally? Because, uh, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm just not focused right now. I'm not? Okay, I, I didn't mute it. Let's go. Let's see, it's been a while since I had to worry about having money. There should be some. You open the door only to be met with a few coins. The girl discounts are quite to around 700 yen. Maybe they'll be on sale. <laughs> Maybe. Do you have any suit to go to? You take a trip to nearby mall known as Neon Paradise? Despite all odds, you somehow manage to arrive without getting lost. Even stranger, you manage to arrive a few minutes early. You decide to wait just outside the main entrance. So, this is the mall, huh? It's really big. And busy. I guess it is the weekend, huh? I can remember the last time I visited the mall. I feel like I must have at some point. I have no idea how to get back home from here. Is that? Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Oh, hey. Glad you could make it. Did you have any trouble finding your way here? N no, no, not at all. So this is a mall, huh? He changed his topic so fast. So he really made it after all. Murder. <laughs> God dang. I love, I love Murasaki aesthetic. I, I want to take it. I'm, I'm gonna steal it. I also love. I, I love everyone aesthetic, honestly. Like, I want to steal every one of them. Like, the style. It's amazing. I'm impressed, but you get minus point for wearing your school uniform on your day off. Oh yeah, I don't really have anything nice to wear. 
And by all means, we must head inside at once. Midori. There are some recording stores to be found after all. Oh, yeah, about that. All ah, right, about that. I am um, didn't really have money, any money to spend. Hey. You came to a mall without any money. You know, just eye shopping. What do you call it? Uh, yeah. Hell yeah, me neither. Let's push up these suckers together. <laughs> base, <laughs> base, base. Let's go. You cannot be serious. One must purchase for himself. You can expect to be comforted just because you know us. Eh, Danny. Eh, eh, me, me. You, money, have yes. I, uh, I suppose I. Do not drag others in your mess. Yeah, you're just asking her because you know she can say no. No, no. <laughs> Get on, Bucky. Got them. Through me. Okay, jeez. For the record, I did bring money. Just stay don't plan on spending it. Come on, Chitra. I'll cover it for you today, but you better pay me back. I'm not sure how many more of these nicknames I can take. <laughs> Shit, bro. You take a step inside and feel a breeze wash over your body. The aroma of freshly produced air conditioned air fills your lungs. The neon light floats the atmosphere, pulling your attention to many places at once. The conversation of several hundred customers all merged together and filled the building. Your body stiffens due to sound pollution overloading your ears. Oh. But your friends can you for. So you follow. Welcome to the mall. Okay, everyone, where shall we go first? Any place you like to go in particular, Shia san? Uh. Arcade, Net Cafe, Library, Close Store. Arcade. Let's go to the arcade, I guess. The arcade, huh? You're just asking to get bullied, aren't you? What do you mean? Oh, Sega Genesis! Super Nintendo, holy! Wow, this place is a bomb! There's also a game over there called The Bomb. That's really insensitive, actually. There's so many games here. What do you think, Shere san? Uh-huh. There's so many... I've never felt this happy in my life. <laughs> I knew it, excitement. What? Whoa. Whoa oh Nerd Freak out and coming. Oh, whatever. You and your music obsession. Oh, goddamn. Get full. Haha, <laughs> who's stealing sick burns now, Kurisan? Che, at least music is a form of art. What, you can argue otherwise? Yeah, definitely. Um, no, I don't have to. That rhythm game over there will do all the talking. Re rhythm game? Oh, how fun! A game which combines the art of music and dance. Hey, hey, Suneko, do you maybe want to uh, play this arcade machine? Hmm? What was that? I wanna play the stupid game made for stupid nerd dweets. I think that's the best you're gonna get from her. Are you them game, huh? I never played one of those. It looks like Murasaki san and Midori sans are having fun with it though. Maybe I'll try it out some other time. When coming to the arcade, you can spend some time playing games. Depending on which one you play, you may become closer with one of your friends. However, it will take up the majority of your time after school. Siza, come play air hockey with us! Isn't air hockey a two-player game? Yeah, we're gonna fight you. Two versus one. It's fair. Dun, dun, dun. Where shall we go next? Hmm. Arcade. Can we go arcade again? Let's go to the arcade, I guess. Oh, it's the same thing. Net Cafe? Let's go to Net Cafe, I guess. Of course they picked that. <laughs> Shut up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, well, now this place is interesting. Sure is. Look at all those computers. Net Cafe in the mall? Interesting. Say, it smells like the future in here. Ch, this is all nerd stuff to me. Like, what can you even do with this? I would watch my math movie if I were you, Kurumi-chan. One day this machine might hear what you're saying instead of like back. Yeah, right. As if they can lose twice enough to process what I'm saying. Hey, dumb shits, you're all going to die in three years. D don't say that. What if Sunny sounds right? Then I guess my ass is terminated. 
Eh, but we're a second sign on this one. I've got a computer at home. The thing can do anything. Uh, yeah, about that. Right? They're so slow. Yeah, and... <laughs> what? 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 Slow, huh? Yeah? So you've, so you've used a computer before. Well, well, that was. I uh, I was just agreeing with you. Hey, look, and I. <laughs> wow, hey, look, and hi. Oh, a what? Huh? Oh, now who's embarrassed? Yeah, hey, remember how I'm covering for you? I'm gonna buy you this using the money you owe me and give it to you. Please don't do that. <laughs> Why would she do that? Boku wa puratu niko ni mushi seidike no mo nanika no josei ni koi oshite umasu. What what the fuck does it mean? That that's what it's called. This is yours now, Chibra. I regret coming here. Remember this next time you're trying to, to make fun of me, okay? This is getting weird. Let's see. <laughs> <Okay. clears throat> this is. This is getting weird. Let's leave the Nitsergi a bit of handy games. Agreed. Gamer moment. Alright then, where should we go next? Library? Let's go to the library, I guess. Fascinating, I was not expecting you to choose that. But she thinks I'm a little afraid to jump something. Goddamn. Hey, we literally just do, do OED. Puss or the puss add up uh, Ohio puss. So this is library, huh? Shh. This is a place of study. Do not join the atmosphere. What? I can't even. Shh. Okay, Jace, I get it. What was even the point of coming here then? Um, I mean, this place is nice and quiet. Maybe it won't be so bad to drop here by here every once in a while. That is, if studying is ever uh, anywhere up in my part there is. When coming to the library, you can some spend, spend some time studying. This will prepare you for exams you might want to do good on, on in the future. This is chapter 2 and I think they are setting up for a more expensive game? That's crazy. However, it will take up a majority of your time for school. Um, yeah, I could study. Or I could read. What is this? You pick up a nearby book entitled A Tale Known as Soul Puddle. The cover features a man with center care standing ominously in front of a purely drawn gravity. This book is unappealing to you. This is unappealing to me. Where shall we go next? Hmm. Cloud store? Let's go to Cloud store, I guess. Yay, clouds! It's not that exciting. Mm hmm. Well, here we are! To be honest, I didn't expect you to choose the clothes out of all things. Hey, huh? Uh, uh. Now I love shopping at. What is this play called? I believe it is called. Le Fashion? Le Fashion. Le Fashion? Yes, that is what I just said. That's the real name they went with. Whatever, who cares what it's called? I wanna buy something French. Don't listen to her, I've got. I've only got so much dough on me. Hell yeah. Oh we oui, it's time to get some baguette. Oh it's alright, I didn't really plan on getting anything. I just wanted to look around. You weren't planning on getting anything? Y yeah? No 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 no, I'm not letting letting that slide. Do you want to save money or not? Let's get out of it now. You are wearing a school uniform on your day off for Christ's sake. You are clearly in need some of some style, my friend. Style? Your outfit, stupid. Gods, pick me up here. Um, I do agree that he does appear to lack any distinct aesthetic of his own. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. we need to change that. Eh, I have an idea. Let's go around and grab whatever you think will look nice on your son. Then we'll meet up at the changing rooms and have him try them all on. Whichever outfit looks the best wins. Ooh, makeover battle? I don't consent to this. We don't need to. In that case, let's put our money on the line too. The losers have to pay for the winning outfit. <laughs> You're on. I don't think anybody heard me say that I don't consent to this. 
Alright girls, let's roll out. I say that on Hey they are already gone. Each of them rushed to upset and store frantically searching through rows and rows of clouds. He patiently leans against the wall next to the changing rooms. Alright, your son, you're ready? They're fine, ready. Oh, come on, I'm sure you look great. The sort of is drying on first. I believe mine. I'm sure to get him something extravagant, something that only the most fabulous of men would wear. Oh, if you win, we're all paying for that, you know. Shinra, you don't look great in that outfit, don't wear it. <laughs> Stop giving me weird, nick weird nicknames. Shinra, huh? So, I guess I don't have a choice. That looks that looks good. Well <laughs> quite marvelous no. Oh wow. It looks really expensive. I was making a joke before, but uh, yeah, I'm not so sure about this one. How, how could you say that? Can you not see his extravagance? Sure the price range is somewhere up there, but isn't it worth it? Yeah, you guess I mean. Hey hey, he looks like a Renaissance painting. This is all very reassuring to me by the way. Alright, well, there's an there's option one. Let's move on to the next. Come on, come on, hurry up. Give me a second. If you're still changing clothes in public store, get over it. What? Well, not all of my comebacks have to be clever. Whatever, mine's gonna be the best. Just you wait. Shiro. Fine, fine, I'm coming out. Oh, that also looks good. Well, what do y'all think? Wow! Good heavens! Such boldness! Such saturation! I'm pretty sure I saw something like this on the internet. Where? Everywhere, all at once. I think it looks great. Plus, it provides an interesting contrast between his look and his personality. But what's that supposed to mean? Alright, then the next. Okay, girls, I think mine is next. Please lower your expression, expectation, though. I went with something a little basic. I didn't want you all to spend too much money. Oh, come on, where's your fighting spirit? No, please, let her. I'm not sure how much more my wallet can take. I'm ready. Oh, that's pretty good. Huh, this one's kinda normal. I wasn't expecting that. Yes, I see. I see the vision. The simple nature of it meshes well with his low energy personality. Since since when did you become a fashion expert? Well, at least it doesn't look too expensive. Very good. Yes, yes, I vote. All right, and the last one. What do you? Oh no. Hey, hey, she guy. Try to actually pull this one off, okay? I was um, not trying before. Right, yeah, but like I shall try, all right. Yeah, sure. I, here, here goes nothing. Not nothing, not nothing. This is something. <laughs> okay. I don't think this outfit will allow me into most places. What do you mean? It, it, it's fine. False. It will allow you into far more places than you will have otherwise. Wow. He looks so. Uh, American. Of course. This is authentic American clothing material right here. Till the letter. This came from a very American cow. It's a. Where's the letter? Now you're just <laughs> very American cow. Now you're just making things up. There's also no letter on this outfit. It's called marketing, actually. Are we done yet? I'm not sure how much more clothes I can take. Well, now that you've tried on different peaks, you get a search here, son. Which outfit do you like the best? Um. Uh, scary casual seriously. Fancy scary. I... I... I don't know. Uh... Ca casual? Scary? Silly? The, the fancy? They all look so good. Honestly, since... This is your first outfit, I would recommend casual. I guess you can mix match it with everything. Fancy is also good. Casual... This is much more casual smart and can go with anything. I'll go with Outkit Sun's outfit. Really? You're going with mine? I mean, thanks. I... What? Huh? 
What is that? I guess it's really less is really more, huh? Less money you take to pay for this, I hope. Where shall we go next? Hmm. All of a sudden your stomach begins to rumble. Sorry about that. I had a skip breakfast. Skip breakfast? Ch cheer, son, you need to take better care of yourself. No, no, I mean, I'm fine, I think. Your stomach rumble wants more slowly louder than before. And you know what? I had a light breakfast, too. I say we stop by the food court and get some grub. That sounds like a wonderful idea. Bucky Chan, what do you think? Err. Uh, Bucky Chan? Hungry? You mentioned food. And now I'm. Starving! <laughs> so dramatic, I love it. Scythe, so dramatic. I guess that's what it called it. Why it's called a drama club. I'm starving! Oh, it's night. You all exit the mall to find Skype and the clash of reds in here, those. Dennis, it sure got light quick. Time flies away when you spend prices high. Uh, no, 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 speak for yourself. I filled every sun leave my pockets today. Well, I suppose it is time for us to part ways. See you all tomorrow. Hmm? You plan on staying here? Oh no, it's just... I don't know where my house is from here. Oh, no worries. I can help you find your way back to school and you can find your way home from there. Huh? No, no there's no need. It's no trouble, really. I live close to school anyways. Ah well, if you say so. Accepting her request to you venture towards school. Well, that mall trip was very fun, huh? Did she enjoy your time here? Y yeah I think so. You think so? When you say you think so, do you really mean it or do you just say it? I'm not sure what you mean. What? Well... Sometimes people say nice things to avoid running the mood. Like if someone asks you how was your day, even if you have a bad day, you will just say good or if it, it was alright. Which is fine, but I want to know if you really enjoyed going to the, to the mall. Or rather if you enjoyed going with us. I did. I did. I did. I mean, I did. Yeah, I did. And I'm just saying that to make you happy. It was fun. I'm glad to hear that, your son. But I would like to ask. And forgive me if this sounds blunt, how about you? Why do you care? Huh? What do you mean? Well, all day you've been asking for my input. What do you think, your son? Where would you like to go next, your son? Huh? Have, have I been annoying you? No, no, not at all. But why go through the trouble of asking me these things? Scythe, as person of drama club, it is my duty to maintain the well-being of my fellow members. Plus, you're our new sedition. I just want to make sure you feel welcome. That sounds like that shouldn't be your responsibility. I suppose. But keeping others happy is what makes me happy. So in a way, you could say this is my own form of self-care. If you say so. Maybe don't go too overboard with it, okay? Sh- Shinta? Are you concerned over my well-being? I'm just saying. You shouldn't beat yourself over someone beating themselves up, okay? You know? Tell a joke, tell a story, tell a truth. For the, for the record, I don't really think I enjoyed myself today. R really? Yeah, I know I did. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> what is that laugh? <laughs> so, yeah, that's how Aoki speak. How does Aoki laugh like <laughs> Maybe something like that. It wasn't that funny, Jis. No, no, it was. You can be pretty clever when you're not stuttering your mouth off. I d d d d don't do that. Hey, wait, you do the same thing. I know, I know, I'm teasing. We're just a couple of stutters, aren't we? Hey, yeah. Oh look, the skull just up ahead. You think you can get home from here? Yeah. Great, see you tomorrow, Shiro-san. Hey, Oki san Hmm? Uh, thanks. 
No, no problem. I'm afraid it's changed the two of you part ways. You feel as if you understand our kiss a little bit better now. You return to your empty home. Ah, interesting. September 8th, Sunday. How many more is in chapter, chapter 2? Holy. So this is the next day. Another week. Hey, it feels good saying that. In a few hours, I'll be right back to the club that brought me here. I wonder what we'll get to do today. Huh? Shunta? Oh, hey, how are you? What are you doing here? What What do you mean? Dude, it's over. It's Sunday. What's over? What's going on? The game, it's over. Oh. It's just a demo, didn't you remember? But, but... But there was only two days worth of content added. That, no, no, that's fine, that's amazing. What was Seth doing for a whole year that he couldn't add any more than that? What Seth did is already amazing, so... God damn. Eh, stuff. Okay, that's fair. Well, now what do, we, what do we do? Go home, I guess. And sit in our crowd chambers for another year. Oh yeah, that's true, by the way. This universe is completely based on reality, but off screen we all slip in cry cryo chambers. And we were all grown from test tubes. Except Danica. Danica is a robot. Danica is a robot? That makes sense, I can see that. Well, I guess it's bye for now. Yeah. For all of us to sing bye back. How rude. You decide that you will find out where he lives and murder him in his sleep tonight. But that will come in a future update. Woo! Woo! Kuro murder update. Hey, you. Yeah, you the narrator. It, me? Yes, that one. Do the thing. Okay. Nothing. Tell the people what to do now that their favorite game is over. Okay, you should check out the link in the description, go to the game page, and check out the game by yourself. I'm gonna go take a smoke break. Also, I smoke, that's canon now. Wow, that's super canon. It's not, it's really not. Well, while Shinta does that, I suppose I'll give you all the obligatory this game is unfinished monologue. As you may have guessed, you have reached the end of the journey, for now at least. I realized that this build might not have been very substantial, and I apologize just for that. I love it. I still love it. But I hope you enjoyed it nonetheless. There are a couple of things I want to go over before this ends, so please stick around for that. Firstly, if you like this game, please tell me about it. You can leave a comment on the HIV page, send me a DM, or whatever works for you. Tell me what you like, what you didn't like, what could be improved, and new spelling error I somehow miss. I want to hear feedback on this, positive and negative, so whatever you want to say about it, go ahead and say it. Secondly, if you want to do a review of this game, or let's play of it, or whatever, you go right ahead. You might have you have my full permission. You sh probably should have put that very early in the game <laughs> instead of here, but okay. In fact, go ahead and send me a link to anything like that, I'd love to see it. Same thing with the fan content, send me any fan art or whatever you got it, got it if you've done any. You don't have to do it if you don't want to, but I do have a Discord server you can join to send that kind of stuff. As well as that lead into my, leads into my next thing. Early join my Discord server for updates and stuff on this game. Honestly, I don't post on there that much and the server is kinda dead at the moment, but if you're really interested, you can do that. For a later time of this book coming out, the music for Bartholomew and Volunteer of the OST should be up on Spotify and on my YouTube channel. They are great! Links to everything on the YouTube page, by the way. That's why I and this is most important. But, honk honk. Thank you for playing. Oh, okay. I thought you were going to say some joke. But that's nice. Yeah, just said. Thanks for playing. You're welcome. Thank you too for creating this game. Again, I know this build didn't really add all that much, but hopefully I can speed things up in the next coming updates. The entirety of week 1 was always meant to be more tutorial phase. So at this point, everything will be established and we can move on to the actual game game. I, yeah, I can see that. From here on out, the game will play out more like Persona, where most they are just spent doing whatever and the story moment happen. During this time, you'll be able to visit the mall and just do a certain activities to increase your stat. You'll also be able to spend one time time with each other girl, much, much like social links and Persona. Don't worry though, there will still be scenes like what we've been seeing, it just won't be every single day like it has been. Man, that was a really long way of saying thank you. Anyway, that's all for me. Feel free to reload yourself and try out some different options. You may find some completely different routes and skins since you do not exist. I'm hey. Uh, I still wonder, uh, does it still come in chapter? As for me, I think I'm gonna take another year long nap. See ya. See ya. So, the game has been, I've been playing it for two hours, but you could say there probably is much more content, interestingly. Uh, so, where was I? 
Oh yeah. Uh, okay. So yeah, this game has been amazing. I can't believe this is developed by a single person with all the animations, the music, and the art, everything, the way it's made and programmed. It's really amazing. Like holy, in a year. That's that's very impressive. Uh, I must say, uh. Nothing much I can criticize about this game, except maybe a little bit of typo, but that's like a very minor thing. And maybe... what do you call it? No, I don't really find any criticism. This game is good. It's amazing. Probably just the... okay, entry. Like, every time you try to enter the game, it will keep asking you, Do you want to do this? Do you want to do this? And I was like, um, Yes, I want to do this. Please just let me get inside the game. <laughs> but it's fine. Either way... Yeah, that's all for Mirror Drama. I hope you enjoyed it. See you later then in the next episode. Oh, I enjoyed this a lot. I, I really love all the characters and stuff like that. Bye bye.